on, guys. What is going on, YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video. My name is always his face, Jasper, and today we're gonna you're gonna be looking at, at the workout that I did straight after I came back from vacation, pretty much. Uh, if you haven't seen the vacation video, go on my YouTube channel right now and watch the video. It's a very fun video. Me and my girlfriend went on vacation together, and it was a lot of fun. I think it's a really dope video. It's a lot of fun to watch. So go check that one out. But now uh, I want to talk about this recovery workout. As I'm gonna, you know, sometimes. We all need some time off the gym, and I just had seven days off the gym, and it was hard. I'm going to tell you guys, I needed to recover from my recovery. Um, <laughs> the, fu the funny thing about that is it sounds really dumb, but what I mean by recovery workouts more like getting back into the flow of working out again. Um, I am leaving for Malmo, Sweden tomorrow, uh, but I will be working out there uh, with the CSGO guys and with, by myself, and maybe even with Tico. <laughs> So I have a, a week of working out in front of me, but you're going to be watching the chest and back workout that I did with my friend whose um, back, chest and arms, a uh, very basic workout, two exercises for each muscle group that we're hitting. So two for chest, two for back, two for biceps and two for triceps. The bicep triceps, we wanted to do a uh, super sets since uh, it costs us a lot of time uh, to do the bench press and we were obviously with two. So um, for time's sake, we did super sets for arms, which always works really, really well. Um, the chest back combination is one of the nicest combinations to have. I usually don't do it because it's harder for me to really focus on one particular thing like chest because I want to improve my chest so much. I don't want to share it with another big muscle group like back. So uh, that's why I usually split it into separate days. But since this was back from the vacation, I wanted to get back in the flow and get back in the feel of the working out. So then chest and back are like two major um, obviously very big muscle groups that you can hit and it feels really, really nice. So that's the reason why we did that. Um, it's also good to do legs with this, but when I do chest, back, and legs, it's just a little bit too much. So I decided to go for an upper workout, and tomorrow, first day in Sweden, I will be hitting a lower workout, which, by the way, uh, the whole Sweden trip, I will be recording, obviously, and putting it up online. So um, first exercise, bench press, five times eight. Um, since it was seven days off, I'm getting back in the flow. Uh, I didn't go as heavy as... Um, I, I normally go, but it ve went very well, so I was really uh, surprised actually but with how well it went. So the last two sets were actually on my the weight that I normally use for five times eight. Um, so I was really happy with that. It's just one workout, you're back in the flow, and the next one you're gonna you know give it your all again, and you you're back on track. Uh, this first exercise for back uh, will be the lead pull down, obviously. Um, after the, the, the bench press, we didn't want to do uh, like a deadlift or something since it was just too much and would take too much time. Um, so we decided to go for a, a lat pull down, getting our lats fired up, and uh, we went quite heavy with. And we added straps, obviously, uh, just to make it a little bit uh, easier. But it felt really good. We did uh, five sets of eight as well with this. So the first two exercises five times eight. The second one uh, w will be uh, three times twelve. So we did incline dumbbell and then a um, under grip barbell row. So um, yeah, the whole workout, by the way, you can find in the description. So uh, if you want to try it out, if you want to do it, uh, go to the description and, and copy it and then you can just do it. Uh, what I also want to talk about today is the fact that I will be doing online coaching very soon. And I am currently working on a website and getting everything like that done because I felt like it's long overdue. A lot of you guys have been asking for it. I got a great, great response on Snapchat for the question, like if someone wants online coaching. Um, so I got like 200 messages of people on only Snapchat, like, yes, please. Yes, 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 yes. So uh, I will, when I come back from Sweden, I will be working on my website and working on getting that fixed for you guys so we can get, you know, we can get fucking better and stronger and bigger together. And this is something I'm really passionate about. I'm really, really excited for. Um, so I'm really happy with that. I just have to do it. Um, I have to, some other stuff I have to take care of after Sweden. So um, a lot of big stuff coming. Also after Sweden, I will be starting a new YouTube series, a bulking series since I've, I've pretty much leaned down a little bit this summer. Um, 
kind of unintentional, but I kind of went with it and, and rolled with it. Um, it's not like I hated it or something, but it was just not really the planning and it just kind of happened. Um, so yeah, I will be doing a bulking series on my channel, like the Gain Train series, That if some of you guys remember that one, which was a, a lot of fun to do and a lot of, um, you know, that was really great. But now I want to do it bigger, better, and just um, have better content, more scheduled content. Like, I probably want to do like Monday, Friday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday videos or like, um, yeah, probably Monday, f Wednesday, Friday, and then maybe in the weekends if we have a fun video to make or something extra, we can always add that in between days or in the weekends. So, um, yeah, a lot of things that are coming and I'm working on um, um, some other things like a diet book, like a l very simple diet guide for you guys and also for the, for the uh, professional teams. So... There's just a lot of stuff coming. Uh, it's just like I went on a vacation with my girlfriend for a week and then I'm home for one day and then, you know, pretty much fly to Sweden right away. So uh, it's kind of a hectic thing right now and I can't do, really can't do much as of right now. But when I'm back from Sweden, we're going to jump straight into it and, and just get fucking going because I'm really, really excited for it. And uh, I hope you guys are too. Um, but yeah, watching arms right now, we did tricep pushdowns uh, with a barbell curl. Very easy standard, both. Uh, we did three sets, and then I think we did 10 repetitions, but I'm not really sure. It might be eight, might be 10. I think 10 uh, repetitions. But uh, the second um, supers that we did for arms were like the, the reverse grip tricep pushdowns, which are quite hard, uh, but they feel so nice. For some reason, they burn just extra, extra hard. So it was a, it was a very great finisher for triceps. So two triceps, two biceps, two chest, and two back. Um, with the rowing on a bend over rows for back, we did also a underhand grip since we did an overhand grip for pull downs. Uh, we wanted to uh, change it up a little bit and do an underhand um, with back hitting it different angles, different grips is always great. Uh, so you hit it as versatile as possible. So uh, this is the hammer curl, uh, both sides at the same time for biceps. Uh, again, three sets and eight or 10 repetitions. I'm not really sure. Uh, so don't quote me on that. But uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the rest of the video. Um, yeah, again, if you want to check out the vacation video, it's really a uh, fun video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like on this, leave a comment. If you have any questions, put them down below. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Oh wait, this video is not even finished yet. So you can keep watching because I bought some new shoes and they're really, really nice. So I'll talk to you guys very soon. Peace. Man, I really hope you guys enjoyed that recovery workout. I'm calling it a recovery workout because after a week of not training, man, training feels good. But the real recovery comes after. Food, obviously, it's so, so important. So as always, we're eating our skier, 500 grams. It's almost 50 grams of protein. This is so essential in my diet. If you're struggling with protein intake, stuff like this, is really really good recovery for me also means buying new shoes <laughs> uh, i just picked up some new shoes um i picked up some new nmds if you guys remember i bought the white nmds uh, white blackish nmds a while back and i wanted to buy these ones first but i couldn't find them anywhere and now i found a store in eindhoven where i never come i checked out the website yesterday and it was also in sale so I was like, hold on a minute. Tomorrow, I am going straight in and buying these shoes. I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, I love this so, so much. Oh, look how clean these are. I love red and I love red shoes. So look at, look at this. Nice, 140 to 95. It's not even really expensive, like it's, it's decent. I think the NMDs look so clean and I love the white. This is like a leather-ish. I love the white, black, red. This is like my favorite color combination of all time. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching this video. Don't take it out too, too, too serious, but I did want to treat myself with a new pair of shoes because yes, I have a very important and very awesome announcement coming very, very soon that I'm extremely, extremely proud of. And um, this is just like a, a little thing I wanted to buy for myself. The only thing that I buy for myself are pretty much shoes. I really don't spend a lot of money other than food and shoes. I hope you enjoyed the workout. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much. Leave a thumbs up. I'll be back from Sweden very, very soon. I'm gonna schedule this video and I hope you all have a great day. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section down below. As always, I will answer you accordingly. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.